Hey, have a great time. Wish you were here with me in the pit. He's fun. See, I love morning television's the best. Morning television's the best. The best. I just connected with me that Rockville in Jacksonville, they're both villas. The Villa of Jackson and the Villa of Rock. Of Rock. Which one's my camera? Which is it? Right over there. Doesn't have a red one. Wherever you right look, right we're going to take They're both back the here. Villa of Rock <laughs> and the Villa of Jackson. And they both have O's in them because me, oh my, and they didn't want me to talk about this, but it hasn't been proven, but uh, Rockville actually causes female and male impotency. <gasps> so it, I would prefer that you didn't go to Rockville, but instead went to the Comedy Zone at the Ramada Inn and Conference Center. And Conference Center uh, here in Jacksonville for my shows tonight, tomorrow. Sunday does not cause female or male impotency. It actually has, it's believed that if you see my show, it makes you leave feeling more virile. Uh, it's almost as if you had an aphrodisiac that was both chocolate and oysters. <laughs> but it tastes better than that. That's so a winning like, combo right there. So the show is yes. very dynamic. Rockville, it's like, it's rock. It's Papa Roach. It's corn who was sued by the plant. That's why it's K-O-R-N. <laughs> It's not, it's not funny. Okay, the actual plant that, corn. That Corn's of, a big industry. So yeah. Obviously, they have the money in the Oh, they were the really upset. Yeah. yeah. So they had to change it to K O R N. And Papa Roach, uh, that's a drug reference, I think. <laughs> so stay away from Rockville. Stay in Jacksonville. Where's my camera? Is it here? Stay in Jacksonville. No, it's over here. Stay in Jacksonville. And you will. So let's play a little trombone because well, the show is. Juggling, terrible ventriloquism, trombone playing, uh -huh. um, uh, one-liners, observational humor, philosophy. It's great. And the best thing about it is it's not political. It's not ideological. It's just fun. It's just take a break. Go laugh. Have a great time. We need it more than ever right now. Are okay, are we going to have a chance Eden, to... are you ready? Yes, I so, guess. Wait, I've already... Yeah, you found that, to, this... and then this. And now you're going to want to just close your lips. You don't have to put it against her, but that's exactly it. Okay. Like, that, like make an elephant noise before you. That, that's not it at all. But tighten, <laughs> tighten really, and then blow through. <laughs> like that. That sounded better. That's it. That's it. All right, now press it against your mouth. Close your mouth. Close it. <laughs> yeah! All right, now try it when you move it. <laughs> okay, so here's what we do in the show. An audience member gets that. I do a one-liner. I'll look Every at time. you. You play it like a rim shot. But I'm so okay. uh, I like Red Bull vodka. Do you guys like Red Bull vodka? Because I like yes. to be awake when I pass out. <laughs> Well, she was ahead of the game on that one. Yeah, yeah. Uh, when you wash your hands, you're supposed to sing happy birthday. Did you know that? Because that's the amount of time it takes to right. hygienically clean your hands. And that's fine. I do it every single time. Whenever I'm the only person in a public restroom and somebody else walks in, it just looks like I'm having the saddest birthday ever. <laughs> can't laugh. We need your help. Oh, no. All right. Wait, uh, wait, wait. Yeah. It is. All right, one more, and this is this is unfair that I'm doing this, but when you wash your armpits, you're supposed to scrub 14 times under each arm to get them hygienically clean. You, you feel like, it feels like you're a guy who knows that, right? I, yeah. um, but that. now that you've heard that from me, you will think of me every time you wash your armpits. I know this because I think about the guy that told me, and I don't want to. So when you wash your armpits, I want you to count like this. TJ loves me one, TJ loves me two, Hit it! <laughs> yes. The first one was appropriate for that exact thing. Okay. <laughs> um, so come and see me. And again, Rockville, it's not only that it's dangerous to your sexual health, it's also that uh, you know, you're supporting a band that actually illegally stole the name of one of the most delicious buttered vegetables that you can eat on or off the cob. And corn the band, in my opinion, is off the cob. Corn the plant, that's on the cob. Okay. That's on cob. Now, <laughs> is, it, is anybody else going to be playing that trombone like when you go back to California or anything like that? Like Drew Barrymore? Well, when I don't go back to California. Oh, nice segue. Was, no, it wasn't meant to be one. Wow! She's a natural. Hold on! No, no, I have a I reason. Mean, that is, that's worthy of getting on this thing. Thank you. No, I yes! have a reason. I'm a super fan of hers, and I would yes. like to know that we shared a trombone. She is well, wonderful. I did a little... movie with her called Focus. The Stand-In, 
and uh, I'm, I am getting dizzy. And then I'm in a film called Underwater with Kristen Stewart, but I started as a stand-up comedian, and I ended as, oh. Oh my God, as, there it goes, my other leg. I ended as somebody, oh, that's right, oh my gosh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's take hit. that back. We were, we're able to do this live television's harder. I oh, hit, wait, when, when you, wait, you ended gotta, my life on a morning show. Okay, oh dear. Oh, so no, she, will, you, will you have her play this and tell her that I played it? Well, no, play a little ditty for her. <laughs> I'm gonna. I actually am gonna do a video, and I want. I'm, I'm gonna send it to Drew here. Right? Please send it. I'm a yeah. huge Drew Barrymore fan. She's I love the greatest. Her. She's so sweet. So <laughs> smart. Thank you. Okay, Drew, we're on River City Live, and uh, we're gonna play a little ditty for you. And that's it. Yeah, that's yeah, it. That's, uh, that's, that's the it. little ditty. That was the whole thing. It's a really short song. Ah! So. That's perfect. It's an original. She's okay. gonna love that. All right, She's so TJ Miller you. is at the Comedy Zone to learn more. Go to ComedyZone.com. Shows tonight. Shows tomorrow and one show Sunday at six o'clock. There's other things in town. If you're in, if you're interested in becoming impotent as a female or a male, go to Rockville Music Festival. Impotency. Org, <laughs> and you can sort of learn a little bit more about that. If you'd like to be more virile, larger, more sort of intimate and connected in the bedroom. Come to the Comedy Zone at the Ramada Inn and Conference Center. Um, and I don't know if you guys have noticed, but every time I say Conference Center, I kind of Bring him in on that one because yeah. you can see the show, have some drinks, eat at GG's, right? <laughs> and have a conference. Just get, get together, PowerPoint, it's a, it's a party. slides, it's a party. So again, Rockville, <laughs> Comedy Zone, mm -hmm. River City Live, yes. yes. Other morning television, Rockville. Nope. Okay. It smells like somebody's been smoking a Papa Roach in here. And we all know that when we defecate, what do we see in that defecation? <laughs> Corn. <laughs> Corn. These are facts. C-O-R-N. All right. Don't forget to send that to Drew. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, I, I think she's going to think it's so funny that it was three notes, and then you were so, you were so sweet. You're like, it's a short song. It's a shorter song. I think it's after this, we song. all need a drink. And guess what we discovered? <laughs> a way margaritas! to make margaritas, oh! lower calories, and I've been, lower sugar. I've been drinking those fat, fat margaritas oh, for no, so you long. Just, you've been drinking the Rockville. The Rockville margaritas. Yeah. And that is, that's margarita mix, uh, tequila, and lard. And uh, and just a, sort of a type of, you know, kind of like the anti-Viagra. So I've been drinking those, and that's called a rock a rock so, Rita. So maybe let's take a look at how to make the sure, good stuff. Sure, let's do that. Let's make a skinny margarita and a fat mistake.